In this tutorial, we're going to look at how to pin table headers to multiple pages in Google Docs. You can see I have a table here about breeds of dogs, and my header is in this tan row. But when I get to additional pages in my document for my table, the header is no longer there. When you have a table like mine that spans across to a second page or further, People using your table have to keep scrolling back up to the first page to view the table headers as they're trying to compare the data from the different pages. Pinning your table headers so that they will appear on every page the table is on will make these long tables easier to read and process. It is very easy and quick to pin table headers. Simply right-click on the header row and scroll to where it says Pin header roll. Click on it and scroll and you will now see that your header row is pinned to the top of the table across all the pages of the document. If you ever want to unpin a table header, you simply right click again, slide down and click unpin header row and it's gone. Now there's an alternate way to pin header rows, and that's by hovering your mouse uh, right over here to the left of your table uh, at the header row, and then selecting pin header up to this row. And now if I scroll to my other pages, you can see there it is again. And that's all there is to it. Pinning table headers is a useful feature that can help people reading and analyzing your table to better keep track of the data and what it means. Thanks for watching.